Hello everyone. My name is Harshit Bhutra and you're watching Digital Sun City. On this channel, I make videos related to WordPress and digital marketing. So, if you want to learn more of WordPress and digital marketing, then you can press the subscribe button below. That way, you'll be notified as soon as I publish a new video. So now, let's get started with this video. As you all know, by default contact form 7 plugin does not allow us to divide the form into multiple steps. By converting your form into multiple steps, it becomes easier for users to fill in their details without getting confused. So to do that, we have to take help of a plugin which I will demonstrate in this video. As you can see here, this is the contact form of my website and I want to break this form into different parts to make it look more appealing. So to do that let's move back to the WordPress admin dashboard. We need to install the plugin first. To do that, hover onto plugins and click on add new. In the search box, search for contact form 7 multi-step. So from the list of various plugins available here, this is the plugin we are looking for. Simply click on install now. You can see the reviews as well as active installations of this plugin. Once installed, simply click on activate. Now this was the first part where we installed and activated the plugin. Moving on to the next step which is dividing the form in several steps. To do that hover on to contact and click on contact forms. You can see I have two existing contact forms on my website. I want to break this help form into multiple steps. So simply click on the edit button over here. Now here on the contact form window place your cursor where you want to break the form into steps. For example, I want to break the form from here so I will simply hit enter. Now you can see a button here named multi-step. Click on it. Now in the pop-up window, you can edit the name of the step and keep it as per your own requirement. In my case, as this is step 1, I am naming it to step 1. Now tick mark the checkbox next to first step as this is the first step of your multi-step forms. If this is your last step in the multi-step forms, check the last step checkbox. The rest of the options are optional. The next page URL is the URL that contains your next form. If this form is the last step, you can leave the URL field blank. So to add a next page URL, we need to create the pages or posts for each step in a multi-step form process. If you have 3 steps, create 3 pages, posts. Since we have not created the pages as of now, let's first create the pages. So let's hover on to pages and click on add new. Let me add the title name first. You can add the title name as per your requirement. In my case, I will name this page step 2. Click on publish after creating one. Moving on to another page, add the title name here. Once done click on publish. Once everything is in place, we need the URL of the page which will contain the next step of the form. So I will simply copy the URL from here. And moving back to the contact form window, click on multi step again. Now in the next page URL box, simply paste the URL which we copied just now. Once done, click on the insert tag button. Now I will cut the remaining code like this as we need to use it in another step. Instead of submit here, type next to redirect users to the next page. Once done, click on save. Now simply click on add new to add another form which will be step 2 of the multi-step form. Let's name this form step 2. Simply paste the remaining code here. Now again I want to break these details into parts. To do that simply hit enter where you want to split the form. Again click on the multi-step button. Repeating the process edit the name as per your requirement. I am leaving these boxes unchecked for step 2. Now to enter the URL in the next page URL box. Let's copy the URL of the page that will contain our next part or step of the form. Let's paste the URL here. Click on the insert tag button. Now I will cut the remaining code like this as we need to use it in another step. Instead of submit here, you can type next to redirect users to the next page. Once done, do not forget to save the form. Moving to the third step of the multi-step form. Click on add new form. Enter the title name of the form. I am naming it as last step because this will be the last step of the form. I will simply paste the remaining code here. 
again click on the multi step button and in this pop up window we need to repeat the process edit the name as per your preference as this is the last step so I will check this box and I also want to send an email to my users after they have successfully completed filling up the form. So I will check this box as well. Once done click on insert tag. Don't forget to save the changes. Now moving on to the next step of the process of creating multi-step form. Moving back to the page named step 2, that page will contain the second step of the form. We simply need to copy the short code and paste the code into the respective pages that we created earlier. Make sure you are in the code editor. Now I will simply paste the code here. Once done, click on update. Similarly, we will copy the short code of the last step of the form and paste it here on this step 3 page. Once done, click on update. Now moving on to another step of the process. We need to set the mail message body so that you can receive systematic emails in your mailbox. To do that let's move to the mail tab here. Since the form was already created, I have the complete mail message body here. You can create one just like this for your respective forms. So I will copy the body of the message from step 1. Now moving on to the last step form, click on the mail tab. Here you need to paste the message body as after completing this step only you will be receiving the emails in the inbox. You can simply create a message body like this. For example, I am adding more fields here that are missing in my form. Once done, click on save. Now you can visit the page where the form is inserted and check whether it is working or not but before that, I have something interesting for you. Sometimes we find trouble receiving emails or we miss them by mistake. So I have an add-on plugin for you that will show you all the entries in one place. So let's install that plugin. Simply hover on to plugins and click on add new. Now in the search box, search for the keyword submission. From various plugins here, we are looking for this one. Click on install now. Once done, click on activate. After the plugin has been successfully installed and activated, you can configure the functionality of this plugin by hovering on to contact and clicking on submissions. Now, this is the inbox area, you will be able to see all the entries here. Let's submit a form and see how the process is working. Moving to the form window, let's input the details here in the form. Once the details are filled, let's submit the form. You can see the success message here. Let's move back to the WordPress contact form submission window. And on refreshing this page, you can see that one more entry has been added here. And on clicking it you can see the details that have been entered into the form. So you can see this is how easy it is to create a multi-step form in WordPress. I hope you like this video. It takes me a lot of efforts to create free videos like these for all of you people. So please consider to subscribe. And if you have any questions or suggestions then you can directly go to our website digitalsuncity.com slash help and then fill in the contact form with your questions. I'll reply to that as soon as possible. Thank you for watching this video. Hey, before you quit, I have an amazing offer for you. I am giving away free access to all of my digital resources to all of my viewers. These digital resources can be divided in two types. The first thing is layouts. This includes hundreds of templates for Divi, Elementor, Visual Composer and a lot of royalty free graphics which you can use on any website. Now the second thing is premium WordPress video tutorials. In the coming weeks, I am creating video courses for all the major WordPress themes and plugins. This will include video tutorials for WordPress, Divi, Astra, Elementor, Visual Composer and lot more. So as you can see, I've already started working on them. Now to get all of these premium digital resources, you have to go to my website digitalsuncity.com slash VIP and put in your email address and then you'll receive an email which will contain all of these things. That's it. So go to the link in the description right now and claim all of these resources instantly. I am waiting for you to get my digital resources for free.